Sometimes the spirit of adventure beckons so much, it's pointless to resist it. Some people find enough courage to get on a train and head off into... outer space? Hmm, no? Also no? Wrong again. These are all wrong stories. Ah, there it is, the forest. This train was passing through impenetrable, dense forests. However, that was not a nameless journey, but a long way up here, right into the heart of the endless snowy nowhere. A perfect place for those who prefer tranquility, silence, and minus 45 degrees outside the window. <sighs> Meet the man who made off into this palace of silence, the engineer. He'll be here on watch duty for many long and cold months, until the next lucky guy strides in to replace him. If one comes through at all, of course. But there's no need to feel sorry for him. Although the terrain is wild, there's plenty to see and do around here. Especially if you're curious enough. Fortunately for my story, engineers are almost always inquisitive and attentive. These people notice things that elude the average person. And everything would have been fine in this adventure if the blizzard had not started at the wrong time. The chilly wind blew the engineer off the trail, which he immediately lost sight of. His fingers instantly turned into ice like everything else around him. The last hope of salvation, a map of the terrain, treacherously slipped out of his hands. Luckily, the video's timing didn't allow the engineer to suffer for long. All of a sudden, in the middle of snowy nowhere, it appeared. A door to... Where to, by the way? The building didn't seem to be on the engineer's maps. Anybody home? This is how it all usually starts. In that strange hut, there was nothing. No people, no warmth, only darkness. If I were you, I'd look for a key. Or something that looks like a key. Maybe just something heavy. That's going to help. Hmm, a heavy blunt object. Gotta grab it. there's nothing left to fix with a hammer. Any other ideas? So, my glorious hero, having passed all the hardships of his watch, finally obtains a light in order to... Hmm. 
to notice something strange on the table? Finally awake? Hmm. A typical day on watch, huh? Such an inventive mind wouldn't have any trouble figuring out the mechanism of a simple trolley. Well, pretty much. Try pulling the other lever. Right now, just slowly. That's a useful book you've picked up. Is the author some kind of scientist or inventor? I hope he's not too upset that we stole his train. That was awkward.
course, I didn't expect to be greeted with balloons and fanfare, but where is everybody? tell you what to do about it, but I have no idea. thing. Well, the goddesses of time and fate can't weave a long life path for everyone. Well, at least he won't be needing the revolver anymore. think this skeleton was so many diagrams on the table he's probably some kind of designer well used to be hmm he left the combination of the safe right out in the open that was a great idea but don't ever do the same thing okay I got an idea. We're gonna need those parts soon. brilliant idea and the details. The console on the platform looks suspiciously similar to the device in the blueprints. It was mentioned there in the train upgrade paragraph.
an engineer. Truly an engineer. Leech is not clever or intelligent. You can hardly call it dangerous either.
see it too? Or am I hallucinating already? Um, can they see us? Hey! Well, whatever.
I see. Can't expect a warm welcome. That's a shame. that sound? Is there someone else in here?
once again. A self-made trolley. Small with... Armed. Motives unclear. Presumably linked to... The personnel has been eliminated on post number... Permission granted to open fire to kill. Over and out. They think we're connected to someone. Huh. We got here on a scientist trolley, through his portal, we're using his notes, we're following his trail. Maybe that's who they're talking about. to warn you about something. Aside from the nasty but harmless creatures, there are other, let's just say, hungry monsters.